is an old standard. Sorry. You can't land here. <laughs> Sabor. Thank you. 
a tune that was written by Nat Adderley, uh, famous for Nat Adderley and who else? Cannonball, of course, Cannonball. Uh, this thing uh, uh, in the program, I think it's written as Jive Samba, but we're not doing it as a samba. So I'm going to call it Jive Cha Cha. All right, so anybody who knows how to dance Cha Cha, get up to date. Thank you. 
good, good time to introduce you to some of the soloists you're listening to right now. On the saxophone right here is a good old friend of mine. Actually, he's from L.A. We did a lot of work in L.A. and we, we even did a couple of TV shows together. Is uh, Mr. D and he lives in Greenville now. Easily. Easily in Greenville. And easily. His, oh, <laughs> easily. Yeah, yeah. Well, he lives with his wife easily. Yeah. And uh, his name is Doug Norwine. Give him a big round of applause. And on trombone here, we have a guy who's stayed, where are you stationed? In Atlanta? Fort Rocker, Alabama. Fort Rocker, Alabama, they have trombone players there. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> and I think originally you're from the Bronx? No. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Everyone was trying to get you guys. All right. Anyway, so uh, we have Miguel Torres. Big round of applause. Yeah. 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 On the congas back here, we have uh, a new friend of ours. Uh, you got him, Lisandro Quintero. I think he's from Venezuela, right? Yeah. 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 Big round of applause. <laughs> On drums, uh, we have a guy uh, from the Far East. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> it's wrong drummer. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, his name is, uh, I think he, you are from Atlanta, right? I'm actually uh, Fort Bragg, North Fort Carolina. Bragg. We got soldiers here. We're safe. Hey, you know what I'm talking about? All right, so uh, Rob Egan on drums. Yeah. Big round of applause. <laughs> on bass, uh, I'm very happy to be together with him again. Uh, we've done, uh, we did last year here, and then we did the Reedy Jazz Festival uh, two months ago, and uh, he's just a great guy to, to, to have on, on board whenever you do a project, because he's right there with you. Gerardo Colón. Yeah. yeah. From the Bronx? No, not from the Bronx. <laughs> All right. On the piano, we have um, the wonderful and talented. Uh, he's got several CDs out, right? He's a concert pianist. He also is a Steinway, what, what do you call it? Artist. He's a Steinway artist. He's an artist for Steinway. He's a virtuoso pianist. And his name is Jose Garcia. Yeah. So the other one was uh, called Jive Samba, so we changed it because it wasn't really Samba. So now we're really going to play a Samba, all right? So this was written by a good friend of mine in Los Angeles. My name is Steve Hubstetter. The name of the tune is Street Samba.
ballad now it's not in the menu uh, again we're just kind of free floating here uh, we're gonna do a ballad that uh, I guess the Fat Jones too and it's a song that uh, I want to dedicate to my son a child is born yeah Thank you. 
We'll sing our C on the piano. Brilliant, brilliant. The funny thing on the piano, you can keep doing that and never get tired. It's amazing. Jeez, how do you do that? Okay, so I'm tired. So I'm going to call for some help here. I'd like to actually, I'm very proud to ask a, a friend to come up and join me uh, on the stage here on the trumpet. Uh, he is a, he's a, a friend of, uh, uh, of, of mine and of Jeff Pirtle. He's also a, a student of Jeff Pirtle. And uh, the, the has been doing the Claude Gordon uh, method and is one of our prize students. And he's going to get up and he's going to help me out with this song, um, Alita, uh, uh, recorded by uh, Chick Corea, I believe, was it? Sweet right. Right. Yeah. So why don't you give a round of applause for Sergio Frade, <laughs> who's come here all the way from Portugal. So we're gonna do a tune that's kind of a new, a different take on a, a tune that's been recorded already. And uh, this is one of those tunes, really, that uh, when a band is together, they play it every night. And about a month later, it starts to come together, and it starts to make sense. We played it for 15 minutes after my lecture this afternoon. We hope it comes out, but we have such great musicianship here. I'm sure it's gonna work out. It's gonna work out great. All right.
Jose Garcia, yes, Steinway artist. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Love it. We can see why, right? Yeah. All right. We're gonna, we're gonna stay uh, with the Steve Hopstead. He wrote another song that I like a lot. We rehearsed it this afternoon. And everybody else seems to like it. So it's called The Message. Whatever it may be.
and it's arranged by our bass player, yeah. Erardo Colón. So, yeah. we're going to mix a little bit of the old standard with salsa.
Fisher tune. I wish I wrote a little song like this. This is such a popular song. Every jazz artist has recorded it. You still probably hear it on the radio all the time. This song is called Morning. We've gotten away from the program, by the way. I don't know if you noticed. <laughs> but we're just kind of improvising. It's the spirit of jazz, making things up as they go along. So here we go. This is Morning.
we're going to bring Sergio back up here to play this, uh, this tune with us. All right, Sergio's back. All right. We lost our colorful, brilliant sax player. <laughs> I thought it was taxi. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, this is the This is Jacks. This is I clogged it. <laughs> I, was, I want to point out that I was delivered by the Claude Gordon method. Oh, okay. For the baby. <laughs> oh, it is hard to wish you well. I, you know, yeah. You can't win them all. Thank you. 
Yeah. yeah.